Imagine living a lifestyle as a black American where no matter how hard you try to get ahead in life, you will never be seen as an equal to your white counterparts. According to Duke's Office for Institutional Equity, American activist and writer Tim Wise describes white privilege as a set of advantages that some say are enjoyed by white people beyond those commonly experienced by non-white people in the same social, political, and economic spaces. White privilege is anything that puts a counterpart beyond socioeconomic status, um, their everyday, day-to-day -day life, if they're receiving anything farther than the other race, in my personal opinion. And white privilege is something that you're born into. White privilege is something that you have to learn because I feel white people aren't aware that they do have that actual privilege. In my opinion, I don't think white privilege exists for everybody who is the color white. You know, honestly, I, I think white privilege exists for anybody who was born in that such a certain scenario or a certain situation where they're just automatically set up for success, either based on the uh, social economic status they're born in, based on the family they're born in, or, you know, based on where they're, 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 what they're born in is in society. So I define white right privilege as, as it's, it's to me is a skin deep um, judgment of someone. White privilege is normal in my everyday life in many avenues, but the one particularly that stands out the most to me is that Southern Miss is male, uh, female and male dominated and they're white. My boss, luckily, I, she, she pours into me and she's black. But if you look at other departments, there are mostly white-driven and white-ran departments. It affects everything in other people other than themselves. And to, to learn. You can't understand something unless you learn from it. And when someone is telling you that, hey, you may have a privilege, don't knock that off. If somebody, if somebody is acknowledging that, hey, your dollar makes more than my dollar, allow them to be teachable because I do think it is on us to teach but you also have to be teachable and you have to understand not from a defensive way but you have to understand that it is a thing and you have to digest that. So tell us what you think about the topic. Definitely go and follow us on social media. Until next time, my name is Kobe Moore and this is Don Herb.